Today, I'm going to show you how you can change any texture into a tune shader or an anime shader. But before we do that, let's add a light to our scene. And for that, I'm going to use my add-on as it lets me save custom light settings. So I will click on this and I have a sunlight. All right, let's move to the shader editor and let's click on our character. And we see that there is already a shader in there. So we'll just use that. Let's add a shader to our GB node right after our principal BSDF. And let's add a mix RGB node node after that plug in your output from the shader to rgb node in the b slot and take the color output of the shader to rgb node and plug that into a color ramp let's change it from linear to constant and let's bring the white slider all the way here okay now plug in the output from the color ramp into the a slot of the mix rgb node and let's also change the mix type from mix to color and if you see that the color is too bright then let's just reduce the slider values here for example you can see the shadows are too dark so to make them lighter just increase the black value to 0.5 and reduce the white to 0.7 now let's add the outline to our character so let's duplicate the mix rgb node and set it back to mix let's take this factor and add a layer weight node and connect it to the facing output now let's add a color ramp and change it to constant again and we are going to move the white slider to 0.7 and there you go you can see the outline already now for the final step duplicate the mix rgb node and the color ramp and this time we are going to add an ambient occlusion node change the samples to 12 and distance to 0.05 and let's plug that into our color ramp and the color ramp into the factor of the mix rgb node and if you see that everything went black it's because our ramp is flipped so let's flip it back and that fixes it and adjust the slider until you see minor details like these and that's it you can just copy these nodes and plug them into any shader and the only thing that you need to adjust is the color ramp here set the brightness of those sliders to your liking and you have a working tune shader and if you like this video make sure to drop a like and also check out how to create a generic tune shader here and I will see you in the next one.